here's the issue. This dollar sign here is money that we want to get from the citizens of Shelton. Okay? This is taxes. This dollar here is the money that we would get from someone else. Whether it be grants, or whether it would be uh, from a, a company moving into Shelton and providing jobs. Here's, here's where I am. I am, because we have taxed the city to the max, hoping that growth would come, and it will come. I, I know before I die, it will come, and we will see some prosperity, but that's, gonna, that's this money here. We need to look at this money here, because even if it's $20 per car, we have a 30% population that's below the poverty rate in this community. And I cannot, in good conscience, ask them to pay any more at this point in time. And Tumwater is a good example, but Tumwater has money. And Tumwater has the ability for their people to pay for these things. We have just increased water, sewer, garbage rates. We've increased recycling rates. We want to increase this. We, we will continue to want to increase these things. We are not at a point to get any more money from the citizens of Shelton. We just can't do it. And so I can afford it 20 bucks. I'm sure Mr. Clark could and Forrest Cooper, I'm sure you could too. But it's not about us. It's about the people that we serve. And at the moment, I have to work for them and I have to understand that they're tapped out at the moment. And do we need to fix the roads? Absolutely. And I would love to find any way we can do it, but we've got to go with this dollar sign here rather than this dollar sign. And that's the best way I can describe it. I can't vote for any more tax increases until we see a store with some significant jobs moving into town, or we see a developer putting in some homes, and we, we just got to get more tax money on a broad base rather than tax the people <coughs> inside the city. That's 